wish I would have saw my family more um, in my 20s. I think that I put my career so much before everything that I forgot about my family a lot. And that is something that I do regret in my 20s is like those memorable moments. Um, because I put my career in like moving um, so far away from home. I just regret not spending time with my family and like missing out on like key moments for my career. What's up you guys and welcome back to another Vlogmas. We are almost done with Vlogmas real soon. I just got home from work. I went to Target. I'm going to cook tonight. But before I cook, I wanted to do like a cute little chit chat. 20 things I wish I would have known in my 20s and so yeah let's do it all right guys I am here and I'm back home um so let me open up some stuff really fast so today we got our blankets from work it says here's to a happy and cozy season and we got a cute little blanket at work super cute this is my little food bag <laughs> So I'm going to cook shortly, but I wanted to do this video. So as I mentioned, I wanted to do a video really kind of like things I wish I would have known in my 20s. And um, I'm actually going to pour this Haitian rum that was given to me by uh, my friend and her family. Shout out to Michelle and her family. And um, yeah, it's a Haitian rum. So we're just going to drink a little bit of this. I know I said I wasn't going to drink, but I feel like I need a little, little pick-me-up. So, I'm going to put it into this glass. Anything is possible. And really, this is very strong. And you get hot very quickly. So, I'm just going to pour this. Cheers to my YouTube fam. I know it's not that many of y'all, but soon we'll have more followers and subscribers. I don't know if it's 20 things, but we're just going to make that the title. <laughs> Cause I really don't know. I think it's like probably one, two. It's like 15. This rum is so strong. Okay, so the first thing I wish I would have known in my 20s is how important credit is. Like, make your credit your priority. Your credit is the most important thing. And my mom would tell me that growing up. So make sure that your credit is straight. The second thing I would say is know your worth like i know that sounds so cliche and it's easier said than done but really know your worth and know what you're going to tolerate and not tolerate there were some things there were some things that like i knew that i wasn't comfortable doing and i did it anyways not did it anyways but i feel like i dated certain people knowing that they weren't even close to the level of me and i think you should really know your worth like there's people that i entertain that just were bums <laughs> when i look back at it so you know really know your worth i believe in having multiple sources of income everybody doesn't one people you know say stick to one thing and i do agree with that to a certain extent however i do believe in having multiple sources of income i feel like just having and dabbling into multiple things will help you financially because I'll be honest, there were there were times where brands paid me and I wasn't getting paid for my regular job. Or in between the two week mark, I had book sales and that was the money that helped me out. So I think, you know, just having multiple sources of income is super important. I can't instill this enough in young people is like, don't just stick to one thing. Uh, these corporations and if we can learn from anything through the pandemic like these corporations will let you go in a heartbeat even if you die five days later they have to re-put your position back on the internet you know what i'm saying so have multiple sources of income the next thing i would say is invest in yourself like invest in yourself baby I put Bianca B before anything and I think more people need to invest in themselves whether that's a product whether that is in classes whether that's a mentor whether that's how your appearance is like really investing yourself in whatever it is that you want to do and don't forget about that and don't forget about you because you can get so caught up in you know working for people or 
you know, your nine to five, I believe in, you know, investing in yourself and having multiple sources of income. You know, college isn't for everybody. It's not a necessity. I personally don't regret going to college. Like, college was the best experience for me. However, it's not for everybody. You don't have to necessarily go. Um, but, especially because everything is online now. But college was fun for me, so eat your zone. Like, do what you feels best for you. I wish I would have found my family more. Um, in my 20s, I think that I put my career so much before everything that I forgot about my family a lot. And that is something that I do regret in my 20s is like those memorable moments um, because I put my career in like moving um, so far away from home. I just regret not spending time with my family and like missing out on like key moments for my career. So see your family more, especially your grandparents. I wish I would have gotten into therapy earlier. I wish that therapy was a priority in my be in the beginning of my 20s. Um, I think that therapy is super important. You can start fixing certain things about you. I wish I would have done therapy sooner. So I highly recommend it. Um, I wish I was a little bit more friendlier <laughs> in corporate settings. I wish I was a little bit more like not so standoffish because I can go in my own little bubble and be kind of shy a little bit or kind of standoffish and I wish I was a tad bit more friendlier. Um, I know I may appear like super confident and I am confident but I am also a little bit shy so I wish um, I wasn't so fucking awkward sometimes. <laughs> And I don't purposely do it. I just feel like I'm just a people watcher and I wish I was a little bit more friendly. This was something I learned. Live within your means. Don't buy everything. Don't always go shopping. Like, I've been cooking lately and it's saving me so much fucking money. I, don't, I always say every year that I'm going to cook more. And this year, that is my big 2024 goal is to cook more because, like, baby, just save so much money so live below your means or within your means when it comes to clothing i wish i would have invested more into basics and good quality shoes um so that's one of my tips and i may forget some but that's all i can think of now and so i'm gonna take this hot ass fur oh the one thing about this rum you get hot as fuck so i just want to put that out there okay guys so i'm gonna end the vlog here i hope you guys enjoyed comment below what are some things you wish you would have known in your 20s it's your girl bianca b make sure you grab my book on shop biancab.com and just a few more days of vlogmas left love you guys bye